Hey guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome back to another episode of The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. I'm having a great day. We're going to try to do Mega Satan today. That's my plan. There is our seed, 6WBRGQH9. And we'll see if we can uh, make this happen. Maybe we can. I'm hopeful. Hmm. <laughs> this is a pretty big floor, honestly. That's not where I want to stand. There we go, one down. Let's try going this way. Stay away. Okay, we're okay, we're fine. Uh, let's fight the boss now, might as well. Little Horn shouldn't be a problem. He is gonna spit annoying troll bombs all over the place, but that's okay. Oh, I really thought that one was going to get him. There we go. He's dead. And we get meat, which is a damage upgrade and an HP upgrade. Very nice. Okay. Um, so we still have to find our item room in our shop. Or, well, probably don't need to find the shop. Just the item room. And it's not that way. Let's try this way. Aha! Success. Come here, you. Hill is question marks. Okay, that's actually fine, considering we don't have a map anyway. There we go. Um, let's just peek here. Just try to get some extra consumables and all that kind of good stuff if we can. Ooh, careful. Doesn't look like there's any consumables here that were really interested in, though. I was kind of hoping we'd find, like, a bomb or a key or something. But, thus far, no luck. There's the shop. Oop, careful. There we go. Well, all right. I guess that's the end of this floor. I was really hoping to find a little bit more there. Ooh, can we get five cents? Nope. All right, down we go. And if we're going for Mega Satan, we got to remember to not take a deal with the devil here. Now, on the other hand, if we get a deal with the devil and it's something like really, really good, like, um, we'll just do that much easier. Uh, like if there's like Brimstone or Mom's Knife or something like that in the deal, we'll go for it because then I think we'll have a chance at Delirium. Uh, which is something else we need. So, I think I'd be okay with that. Hey, thank you for the key. I appreciate it. Let's blow up this tinted rock. And I'm going to take a spirit heart. I'm not going to take the other one. Right now. Getting lots of money. That's good. Self-sacrifice room doesn't matter. Let's go this way. Careful. Ooh, there we go. Lovely. What do we got in here? Ugh, it's not very good. Let's keep going. Uh, actually, yeah. Give me void. Why not? That's going to give me spirit hearts. So now that we have extra spirit hearts, I'm going to go back and I'm going to grab this one over here. And that way, if there is an amazing deal, we can take two deal items. There we go. What do we got here? More money. I do like money. We don't have any keys though. Or bombs for that matter. Okay, there we go. Ooh, you got me. That's all right. Oh man, careful. Grab this. All right, we're good. There's another tinted rock. I'm loving all the tinted rocks. It's very nice. There we go. Don't get hit by that. Ah, then I got hit by that instead. Well, fine. Uh, grab that. All right, let's go fight our boss. Health situation is good. 
everything else is a little scary. And this room. There we go. We got one. Die, please. Thank you. What you got for me? Growth hormones is lovely. Let's see what we got in here. Ooh, the pact and the ability to fly. Like, that's a pretty good deal. All right, we're going to do it. We're, we're going for a delirium run. I've decided. We'll try for delirium. Uh, don't spend our one key on a golden chest. That's just silly. There we go. Okay. And, oh. There we go. Got him. Pill is a health upgrade. That's nice. You know what? We've only got this one, like one hit and we lose that heart. So let's not lose that. We can fly in here. Check this out. Eh, not really worth it. We want to fly out because I don't want to lose this heart. Our bone heart is important. There we go. Ooh, that's actually a really good trinket as this character. Because you've got that increased range on the melee attack. Please die. There we go. I'm going to wait for him to pop up so I can do that. There we go. And there we go. Lovely. Ooh, and you got to take the D6. For sure. No. 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 <laughs> Come on, give me some. Oh, sure. We'll take Stigmata. Damage and HP? Yeah, I think that's worth it. Um, ow. Okay, so what we want to do here is keep that heart alive. Okay, uh, let's blow this up. Not worth it. Didn't give us anything. That's fine. I mean, I suppose we could also play a self-sacrifice room as a, a method here of, you know, Mega Satan. We'd need a lot of red hearts to do it, but I, like, it could be done. Maybe. I don't know. Like, playing a self-sacrifice room as this character is a little scary. There we go. I'd really like to get another red heart before we, uh, go fight the boss. Red heart? Nope. Gave me a key, though. Bombs? I mean, we're getting closer. Uh, just grab the penny, please. Thank you. I mean, the consumables are lovely, but I would really like a red heart, please. Okay, this is not a room that we want to uh, melee attack with. That's just a terrible plan. There we go. Hey, that's what we needed. Uh, and you know what? This is probably our second secret room right here. Yep, that's what I thought. We're gonna blow you up. And we got our bomb back. Got an extra penny. All right, let's go fight the boss. Rag Mega. Oh, this is an XL floor, isn't it? I had almost completely forgotten. Uh, okay. So, let's not lose this heart. Please die. Have I ever mentioned how much I hate this boss? <laughs> Him and his stupid, like, I'm just going to be invincible for ridiculous periods of time. Yeah, don't get hit. I mean, if we lose the spirit heart, it's not the end of the world. There we go. Uh, we honestly, we probably should have rerolled that. And honestly, now that I remember that this is an XL floor, let's go back and find our second item room. Which has to be in this general direction. There we go. Well, I mean, the consumables, again, are lovely. But what I'm really looking for... 
is a little bit of HP. So we can keep this bony heart alive. And we're up to 12 cents. I mean, we could, I suppose, one option would be we could go into the store and buy a red heart, but that just seems like that's three cents and a key for a single heart, and that just seems a little bit not good. All right, there we go. What do we got in here? Turdy touch. Let's re-roll that. Uh, sure. We'll take skinny odd mushroom. We'll grab the battery. I might as well clear this room as well. Okay. We're fine so far. This guy's gonna be dead once he pops back up. Uh, pop, pop back up, please. There we go. And our damage is fine. I mean, everything's good. We're, we're okay. We're still in need. You know what? Let's do it. Ah, still no red heart, huh? Okay, stay back. There we go. Lovely. Well, the consumables are great, but didn't really give us what we need. Now, with that said, we now have 15 cents. So let's run to the shop. We're taking our time here, but it's okay, because this is an XL floor, so we're still going to be, like, well on pace for boss rush. <sighs> I gambled, and I lost. That's fine. I don't really need a uh, nun's habit that badly. Ah, you jerk. One more good hit and he's dead. There we go. And we don't need that because we're already at the tears cap. I mean, I was really hoping for an angel deal. Or, uh, well, actually, we can't get angel deals, so disregard. Pretend I didn't say that. And there's a lot of pills here. So let's see here. We got a Horf, a Range Up, a Question Marks, and an Explosive Diarrhea. Okay. Uh, and then we can Ace of Clubs all of these empty chests into bombs. So that actually worked out. Let's reroll this. Sure. It's better for us than uh, Torn Photos, surprisingly, considering Torn Photos is actually pretty good. But we're already at the tier cap thanks to Skinny Odd Mushrooms, so... Torn photo wasn't really doing anything for us. And our range on the melee attack is, like, actually incredible. All right. I love seeing a heart there. Don't get hit. Like, our range on this guy is actually, like, basically a Zazel range. Oh, Hello. Uh, this is what we call decidedly not worth it. Like, just no. Now, on the flip side of that, we do have the D6. So we can reroll this stuff into better stuff. And we have a fairly good chance we're just going to earn a devil deal, like, naturally. Uh, let's reroll that. I'll, I will totally take Spoonbender. It's a fun item. There we go. So what we're looking to do is earn a devil deal. But make sure that we have enough battery charge left to actually re-roll that whole deal. Because the deal just isn't very good. Um, toss that in there. What you got for me? Troll bombs. Okay. And no spirit hearts. Fine. Money, please. Eh, not as much as I was hoping for. Let's check this out. You really want me to take Nun's Habit, don't you? Okay, well, for seven cents, I will take a Nun's Habit. And I will totally take a seven cent Mom's Key. And then I don't think you want to reroll anything else there. Not just yet. Maybe if we get a little bit more money. 
But we're still looking for our item room on this floor. Uh, yeah. Give me that, because I'm not coming back for it. We can just whack away at those guys for ages. It's lovely. So item room basically has to be down here, I guess. There's nowhere else for it to be. There we go. Ah, I finally got hit. Ah, and it gave me a heart immediately, which I appreciate immensely. Thank you, game. This guy's gonna, yep. Okay, what do we got in here? Sad onion. Do you want sad onion? I don't think you do. We don't need it. I mean, piercing shots, I guess, is nice, but like, it's just, just no. We don't need it. So, and the downside is that it would, I, I think it's a significant range down. I know it's a huge shot speed down, but I think it's a huge range down as well. Okay, get rid of the little gish guys. Ah! Still managed to get hit. Okay. This dude is so dead. I'd love to reroll little gish too, but our reroll has to be for our deal. So, swing in here, reroll. Yeah, that's a lot better. Take that. Take you. We'll take a little gish. I am gonna go back and find our shop. Uh, which was... Yeah, this is the downside to Curse of the... I can't see. I think... Oh, actually, I think it was up here. Maybe? Like over... Yeah, this is our shop right here. I'd like one spirit heart, please. And I would also like this. And then we are gonna go back and reroll Sad Onion. Do 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 do. Reroll. Yeah, that's a little bit better. Just a little. Pyromaniac is kind of amazing, no doubt. Perfect, protects us from all sorts of stuff. Dude, this run is amazing. This is a very, very good run. I'm, like, very pleasantly surprised. I'm glad we decided to... I mean, we've gotten two devil deals. After a reroll, they've both been very good. Our damage is great. We're at, at the tier cap, or, you know, the rate of fire cap. We got Sack Dagger for a little bit of extra protection. We got Pyro. There's a Bone Heart there that I can't even pick up. So, with that Bone Heart there, maybe... If possible... We want to try for a self-sacrifice room. Oh, that's right, and these guys can't hurt me because I'm... Uh, we'll stick with the Chariot. Uh, because... I have Pyro, so they got nothing on me. There we go. We're gonna have to see how a self-sacrifice... Oh, ho, ho. well, that's okay. We didn't actually lose the character. This is our mom fight, though, and we don't want to do that. Not just yet. Not unless we get a teleport card. If we get a teleport card, then bets are off. That's uh, question marks. Full health, Full health is lovely. I will totally take Mom's Perfume, since it's a tier cap increase. And then let's pop the Chariot. Wow, you gave me a blood bag. Okay, I'll take it. Um, Is there anything else? I don't think there's anything else we want to do on this floor. Let's go fight. Uh, First, let's check secret room. A lot of red hearts. You, we gotta look for a self-sacrifice room on this floor. You have to. With that, like, we could totally play a self-sacrifice room. You have to look. Because then that's our keys to Mega Satan. 
And there might not be one, and maybe we're throwing away our chance at boss rush, but... but like, that's okay. There we go. Uh, we'll check this. Grab this. Uh, yeah, we'll just take it on this guy. But that means we need to explore the entirety of the floor. We might be able to explore the entirety of the floor and still make boss rush, honestly. Check here. Nope. No secret room. Okay. And there probably won't be a self-sacrifice room since we had one on the last floor, but you never know. That was close. Thank you for these rooms that are super easy to do since I can fly. I appreciate that immensely. All right. We are heading to the boss. We'll have a chance at boss rush. I don't need the bone heart. Uh, check here for a secret room. Yeah, there it is. Blow this up. No dime. Okay. That's fine. Uh, fine. We'll check the shop. We can beat mom pretty quick. There we go. And actually, I'm fine with getting the money here because... Easiest way to get delirium is through hush. So, we'll do it that way. All right. Now we go and we fight mom. And it's blue mom. So, sack dagger is totally going to be a thing that we use and a lot. Ow. Don't die here. Unfortunately, the foot drops count as explosions, but there we go. That's all done. Uh, it doesn't matter, so we'll take the Polaroid. And then we'll look at boss rush. Ship to whoop is great and all. Yeah, none of that is worth it. Uh, actually, I've got pyro. Thank you. And actually, with Pyromaniac and 17 bombs, we can do a self-sacrifice room that way. So we just need to look for a self-sacrifice room. We just gotta find one, and then we're set. Okay. Die. Ansus? Well, Ansus is great, but not on this floor where we have no map. Okay, where's this last dude at? Where are you? Oh, there's one up here. He's dead. That That's it. All right. Um, sure. We got tons of bombs. There we go. Okay. I have a feeling this room is going to be annoying. But we've done it. High Priestess doesn't matter. Careful. And then sack dagger. And we have a full heart here. So we'll swing in, check this out. That gets us back essentially to full HP. So far so good. Still gotta find our boss, obviously, but we're we're clearing these floors fairly quickly. So, if we're gonna do Delirium, we gotta fight Hush. Which means if we're gonna do Mega Satan, we basically need to find a self sacrifice room within like two floors. That was uh, my finger actually like slipped on the keyboard. Okay, there we go. Thank you for the health. Can take a lot of these guys out from over here. Pop up. There we go. Let's just do one of these. Ooh, that was close. Let's fight the boss. All right, you sack-daggered me. 
and you are essentially dead. That went pretty well. What do we got in here? We got a reroll is what we got. Ooh, absolutely give me Maw of the Void. And I don't think Demon Baby is worth it. I will take the cube of meat. And we are down to the next floor. <laughs> so I'm kind of thinking maybe... Well, we got an Ansu, so let's pop this first. Do we have a self-sacrifice room? We do not. No self-sacrifice room on this floor. Careful. That's one down. And two. We can go in here, check this out. We'll do it. Hello, Cricket's Head. You have become my friend. Oh, and we got Spoonbender as well. I totally forgot Maw of the Void is gonna be like incredible. And a two of clubs, okay. So the question here becomes, do you go Delirium? Or do you try to get a self-sacrifice room in the cathedral? Which is a thing that can totally happen, but. All right, what do we got here? Retrovision. I can see forever. Okay, that's fine. Uh, there's no sense in going over there. We can get into our secret rooms for free. Hello, Greed. Man, dude, you just keep giving me good stuff. And a tier's up that doesn't matter because we're already at the tier cap. That's fine. Let's swing over here. Oh, careful. You know what? We're at the tier cap. Or we're, uh, there's no reason we need to take damage here. There we go. Let's see what we got. Blow you up. I'm not playing a blood bank. Thank you for the heart. All right. Away we go. So we're at 18 damage. I regret that one. Thank you for the lucky penny. really make sure we keep our HP as high as it can be. There we go. That was easy. Don't get hit by that. And you have all the red hearts again, which would be awesome if there was a self-sacrifice room on this floor. But there isn't. Orf. Well, I think we're just gonna go. Ow. I mean, uh, we, we have this permanent polar invincibility at the moment. Let's finish mom off. And we did actually earn a deal. So, reroll that. Goathead, it just, it, it's just not needed at this point. We're at full HP. Like, I, ah, man, I wish I could carry two trinkets. That's all right, though. We don't really need the extra money. So, we're going to go down to Hush. We have beaten Hush, right? Yes, we have beaten Hush. So, this is the fastest way to Delirium. Curse of the Blind. Wow, that stinks. <laughs> uh, Black Candle? Wooden nickel. There's options. Okay. Well, uh, reroll you. Black handle. Champion belt. Okay, well, it's actually good. And then... I mean, we can pop all of these. What are you? Ace of hearts? Okay, let's use our two of clubs. We'll take Ace of Hearts. We'll see what this is. Bob's Rotten Head. Okay. So, re-roll you into the Parasite. Okay, that's nice. And then we'll go top and bottom. And that's all pretty terrible. Um, We might have a chance to re-roll that if we take a lot of damage on our Hush Fight, which obviously we're going to try not to do, but still. 
Uh, we'll check this as well. Chariot card. Probably better than the Ace of Hearts at the moment. Okay, let's go. Uh, and we'll just do one of these. We're gonna get a ton of money over the course of this fight. We don't want to get close to this dude if we can avoid it. There we go. Stand behind our little skeleton friend where he can't hurt me. Parasite's great and all, but it's not really doing much. I was hoping that with uh, Spoonbender, the Parasite tears would all like bounce off and it would be this like glorious thing, but that's not happening. Either way, we're still like fairly safe hiding behind our skeleton friend. Okay, we'll get nice and close so we can get in there with a nice... There we go. Again, hide behind skeleton friend. And I can afford to take a couple hits here. Like, it's fine. This guy, on the other hand, that's gonna be a problem. Yep, can we... Yeah, we made it out, we're good. The fly army is a little bit of a concern. But now we got black hearts popping up. All right, all the continuum shots coming in. Yeah, don't stand there. Right here, I think, is where you want to be. Should be safe here. It's going to be a little bit of a longer fight, but... That's all right. It's hush, it's always a long fight. Thank you for the black hearts. That gives me a lot of wiggle room to mess this up. Also, since we have that spirit heart out back, like I can take quite a few hits on this and still leave the blue womb at full HP. So I'm not like super concerned just yet. Yeah, let's get away from all this nonsense. I mean, here, it doesn't really matter. We might as well stand right here. Okay, yep, you got me. Dude, can you please stop with the beams? I lost a heart. Okay, well, it's fine. We'll just keep going in there with Maw of the Void if we can. I've noticed you can't melee attack when you're Maw of the Voiding. So we are not going to be at full HP, but we'll be fairly close. Uh, and I, like, I don't think this will trigger... Ah, oh, man. If I'd taken one more hit, we could have re-rolled. <laughs> and I can't hurt myself. Like, there's no way for me to, to hurt myself, unfortunately. Because I would love to re-roll this. But that's not happening. Oh, well. That's fine. All right. I guess we're going down to Delirium at this point. We do have Pyro, so, you know, we can we can make that work for us. We should test something with Pyro. If I put a bomb and then switch to Soul Boy... Oh, actually, we, oh, and I can't see my HP? That's actually real bad. Gulp, Gulp I... Did I have a trinket? I don't know that I even had a trinket. This seems really good with the parasite, though. The bone club just sprays parasite stuff, like, everywhere. Ah. It's all right. Grab this. We're fine. Haven't lost a bone heart. More bombs is more health. 
There we go. Another gulp trinket. Okay. Careful. You know what? You guys stay over there. And get dead. I would like to know what happened to my Maw of the Void there. I guess I was watching the wrong charge bar or something. No luck upgrades. Orf. Not a very useful pill. Ow. Well, I got bombs. I'll take the heal. Let's be smart about it. I just stood there and let that one hit me. That was stupid. What is this? Finger bone. It looks brittle. New trinket, for sure. Don't ask me what it does. Maybe it has something, maybe it makes bone hearts drop more often or something? I, I genuinely have no idea. I should be safe in this corner. Oh, they keep they keep firing. Okay, we're good. Explosive diarrhea. Not what I need. Thank you for the heal. What you got for me? Black feather. We don't have any sin items, so it doesn't actually do anything. Nice. I mean, you, you probably... What are we going to use that many keys for? Let's be honest. Alright. Get sack daggered. I gotta say, I like this room. This is a new room, and I like it. Any more orange fires? No more orange fires. I'm shocked that we haven't seen a single boss yet. Golden Bombs is great. That is essentially infinity health. There's a bomb finally, but this could be or a boss, I should say, not a bomb. But this guy could be delirium, so I don't want to go in there just yet. I think I want to make sure we try and fight delirium last if at all possible this one is probably not delirium and you're dead um well the tears upgrade does nothing for us and like book of belial would contribute to Bookworm, but it's unlikely we'll get Bookworm at this point. You know what? No, see, take Book of Belial. Reroll it into Dad's Lost Coin. I was kind of hoping we'd reroll it into something a little bit better than that, but okay. Or maybe what we should have done is just left it there so we could take, uh, take it into our boss fight. So this is not Delirium. Okay. Give me a maw, please. And we won. And I mean, wow, that's actually a really tough choice. I think you go crown of light. Because the thing is, right, like, you're going to get such an absurd damage bonus from Crown of Light. Yeah, there we go. We're at 40 HP now, or 40 damage. 
And in order to make, well, actually, we had a second guppy item, didn't we? We we had picked up Guppy's head. I was thinking we didn't have any guppy items. Oh, hi. There we go. I had forgotten. Okay. That's all right, though. I still think Crown of Light was the right call. What you got? Nothing I need. Because we're basically going to be able to one-shot, like, everything that isn't a boss. Oh, hi. And our Maw of the Void is just going to do, like, obscene damage. I got hit. It's okay. I'll take my health back. Ah, uh, health up, actually. That gets me to full HP. I'm good with this. This could be delirium. In fact, no, actually couldn't, because it's got a, another room bordering it. So, kill him. That's a reroll. And you definitely take Cat of Nine Tails. So we've gotten, like, some fairly good items here from our non-delirium boss fights. That one actually legitimately could be. It is, it is possible. So we'll hold off on fighting that fight just yet. Golden keys. Okay. That could also very well be delirium. I think. Anyway. It appears that way. Okay. So far, so good. This is just a dead end. Is this our only boss? Uh, we only have two boss fights left. Maybe. There might be a third. I thought there was one more boss, but maybe I'm wrong. No, I guess not. Okay. So we have a blood bag there. I don't think we're, we want to play it. I mean, well. Well, we don't. What, are we, what, are we, what would we be looking for? <laughs> maybe an item to reroll? I guess. Yeah, there, okay, so there's there's a couple of bosses. There's, I guess we never went back for that one in the lower left. So let's fight you first. And you will die absurdly quickly. Goodbye. Okay, I'm going to leave those in case I get hit and lose a heart on my uh, fight with this other boss. I, I actually want that, please. Thank you. And I don't think we've taken any damage as the soul, so I think we're at full HP on both. I don't know for certain. Wow, that went really well. Um, I mean, we don't need fate. Honestly, I think we... I think we reroll them both? And we'll take the range upgrade. Surprisingly, which gives us the mom transformation. And then I think we'll go, we'll go back and we'll take Bob's Curse for bombs. Because now we know we only have one fight left. And it's, it's Delirium. Like, it has to be. And with Golden Bombs, might as well do something for a bomb synergy. As minuscule as it is, we're already at full HP. So we don't need any of that stuff. I guess we just go for it. Like, this is it. Final showdown with Delirium. And I think you probably want... I mean, the explosions are actually helpful for me. Okay. So I think what we want to do is play primarily as Bone Boy. 
because we can replenish HP. Right now, we haven't actually lost. We lost the one heart, but um, that's where it's going to be careful. That's where we're going to have to be, like, super careful is, you know what? Okay, there we go. Where you at? Okay. Got a little horn wannabe right here. Yep, so now, bomb. I, I missed it, because I was dodging. There we go. Ah, I still got hit. No! All right, we're trying to do like, the bomb thing is, is not really working for me as well as I thought it was going to. So let's switch up our strategy a little bit. Where's Ugly at? Way down here? Yeah, I'm not gonna reach him. Okay, I got hit. There we go, got our HP back. Oh, careful. There he is. Okay. Blow up. Thank you. Yeah, all the troll bombs that you... Okay. I don't know how many hearts we've lost. I think we've lost three at this point. So we're just going to try and stay on him over here. Unfortunately, we're kind of like stuck in a little corner, but... And we don't have a ton of HP to give away. Ah! <laughs> I got... I healed, and then I instantly got hit. Okay, there we go. Now we're at full HP. Or full... As full as we can be, anyway. I think we're okay? Like, the, the fact that I can't see my HP right now is actually killing me. Okay, careful. Wow. You and your telefrag. Ooh, careful. Thank you. Okay, got the heal. Stay on him. Now you're way over there. Alright, I got hit. But we're so close. Like, we're there. We just need a little bit more. And then Delirium is ours. Yep. Okay, stay over there. Don't ask me how some of these shots aren't hitting me, but I'm not gonna complain. Oh, there we go, finally got hit. We're so close. Please die. We've done it. And I will never know how much HP I actually had. But we made it, we beat Delirium. It was a successful run, I will take it. Awesome, and we've unlocked The Book of the Dead. Okay, interesting. Guys, that's gonna do it for today's episode. If you enjoyed the video, you know what to do. Link's in the description below, so check that out as well. Otherwise, my friends, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.